Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of I Review Day. This time we have Pop Tarts. Uh, now these ones are Frosted Apple Blast flavor. Um, first, talk about the uh, packaging, the price, uh, nutritional info, and yeah, it's just, it's just a basic of what these are. So. Here, starting from the uh, the very top, we've got 400 grams, eight pastries, uh, frosted apple blast flavor, apple flavored filling in a frosted pastry. Um, got nutritional info: 1,650 kilojoules per 100 grams, 4.4 grams, 10.7 grams of fat, uh, 68.9 grams carbohydrates. So 3.1 grams sugars, um, dietary fiber 1.4 grams, sodium 325 milligrams. Um, so that's for two of these. That's for two pastries, 100 grams. All right. Uh, contains gluten containing cereals and soy. Wheat flour may contain traces of genetically modified corn slash soy. All right. Um, then we just got the chocolate ones advertised here, and warming instructions, which are remove pastry from pouch, drop pastry vertically into toaster, which we've got here. Attend toaster while heating. Children should be supervised. Note: use the lowest heat setting. Pop tarts are pre-cooked and require warming only. All right. So, I'll turn this down to the lowest, which it is already on. Alright, now we're going to open this and see how it goes. So, to open slide finger under tab, lift gently. So, we're going to do exactly what it says. Slide finger under tab, lift, lift gently. Oh. Yeah, see, do you see me crinkle out a bit when I was trying to get my finger under it? It's not. Not great packaging, but it is what it is. Oh, we've got an important warning here. Read instructions on side of pack before preparation. All right. So we've already got that now. This is another caution warning. Which pastry may be too hot to handle. Allow to cool briefly before removing from the toaster. Do not heat in microwave. So that's good. Um, so it looks like we've got four packets here. So I'm assuming there's going to be two in each. It's got four packets. What we're actually going to do is we're going to try one raw and one cooked, right? So let's read what this says. Uh, yep, so it's got the same instructions that are on this. Um, Twice. Do not microwave in this pouch. Alright. Then on this side we've got Pop Tarts Apple Blast flavor. And contains gluten containing cereals and soy. So let's open this one up. Let's listen to this. Yeah, that was a lot easier. Alright. Ooh. They smell good. They sure do smell good. But how do they taste? So what I'm actually going to do, a bit broke off, it's alright, I'm going to chuck one in here, and press it down, and then I'm going to eat this other one, um, raw, I'm just compare the difference, let's try this. Let's break it in half. Alright. Should be better. 
once it's out of here, but it's not bad, I quite like it. While this is toasting, let's quickly run over the price. So we've got a receipt here. Um, 400 grams, five dollars and thirteen cents. It wasn't on sale. That was just the uh, raw price outright. Um, which I'd say is pretty good for eight eight pop tarts that you're getting. Five dollars. That's pretty good. I think I'd be more comfortable. There we go. I think I'd be more comfortable buying them if they were on special. Okay, yeah, it is quite hot. Um, but you know, it is what it is. They're quite good as well. All right, so I'm just gonna put this one here. Now let's remove this one. It's quite hot. Let's remove it and have a taste of it. Let's have a look at it first. Mmm. Smells. Yeah, it's. Bit. It's gone a bit brown if you compare this one to this one. Of course, the toaster is gonna cook it. You can never. That's before and after. Have a look at that. Um, but. Let's. Break this one in half and see what it, it's like. It's quite hard. Also quite hard to break by the looks of it. But look at that. Oh yeah. It's quite hard. But it smells good. It's also quite um quite quite bendy. That's alright. Try some of this. It's a small bit. It's quite hot. Mhm. Mm yeah. That's better. That's better cooked. Or toasted, it's better. You know what? I quite like it, it's quite nice. Um, would I buy them again? Probably, but not for a while, um, since I've got a lot here, and I'm not gonna have, you know, two or more a day. Like, it's gonna take me a while to get through all these because they are quite, they're really sweet, they are quite sugary. But yeah, um, apart from that, in summary, I think it's Really good value for money. Um, you know, five dollars for for all of this. I think that's quite quite good. The weight kind of threw me off because they felt really heavy in the box. I mean, four four hundred grams and a lot, but it feels like a lot. Um, but yeah, they're quite good. The only bad thing I'd say is they are really hot when they come out of the when they come out of the toaster. So it's up to you whether you would whether you prefer them, you know, just raw like this or or cooked a bit. Um, I feel like they taste better cooked. Mm. Not really much of a difference other than it's warmer. So, it's up to you how you like them. It's up to you whether you buy them, how many you go through, a day, whatever, a week. But, that's all for this video. So, if you liked it, give it a like. Click here if you want to subscribe. Click here to watch the next video previous video and that's all for me so how's that we just got one step closer to reviewing every product in the world so boom